In front of a massive crowd in San Jose, presidential candidate Bernie Sanders made his final pitch to California voters. And we are opening up the door for young people in an unprecedented way to get involved in the political process. Ahead of his rally, we sat down with him one on one, where the Vermont senator brushed off Joe Biden's big win Saturday in South Carolina. Joe Biden had a big win there. People are calling this his comeback moment. Do you see this win as a threat in any way to the momentum well, in your campaign? Let's see what happens on Tuesday. Uh, all I can tell you is we have thousands and thousands of volunteers uh, knocking on doors here in California and all across this country. I think we're going to do just fine on Tuesday. Sanders has campaigned in California more than any other candidate, and he's currently leading in the polls. We asked him about Pete Buttigieg, who ahead of dropping out Sunday, told us Sanders' campaign is too divisive. Our issues are bringing people together around an agenda that works for all. That's not divisiveness, that's standing together to fight for change. Well, let's say you do win the nomination. What will you do to reach out to more moderate Democrats who are still a little bit uncertain about democratic socialism to bring them into your campaign? Well, what I think is that all of the Democratic presidential candidates will be united in making sure that we do everything humanly possible, humanly possible to defeat Donald Trump. Uh, and I think the overwhelming majority of the Democrats, whether you're conservative Democrat, progressive, moderate Democrat, we're going to come together. At his rally, Sanders went after Joe Biden for his Iraq war vote. He also talked about that key question of electability. He told us his enthusiasm is what gives him the edge. I think the real challenge that we have is how do we create that very large voter turnout that we're going to need in order to defeat Trump. And I think our campaign is uniquely qualified to do that. We also asked Sanders about Nancy Pelosi's House seat. There's a Democratic Socialist running against Pelosi and several of Sanders' supporters and even surrogates, including Susan Sarandon, have endorsed him. Sanders declined to comment on the race. He did, however, say that he has known Pelosi for a long time and that she does a good job given the circumstances. In San Jose, Liz Kreutz, ABC 7 News.